This is Stephen Box, New Kern Association with Supreme CBD. How are you, mate? It's good to see you back, mate. I haven't seen you for ages, Ant, how are you? Oh, I've not seen you for a while as well, mate, but no, it's good to see you back. Good to see you back. No, good. Obviously, a bit disappointed then. Obviously, it's never nice when the fighters lose, but listen, it was always going to be a big, big ask. It was just, you know, a bit sitting when the trainer's eyes did, and he just, he just got caught, got beat through a shot. Um, I thought they both landed at him and Ben. I said that to Ben's dad then, and um, a few people to me went, and I thought Lee Bell had looked down and he blinked again, he was, he was down. Yeah. And then Ben, but Ben looked really good tonight. Listen, I've got to give Ben credit as well. Ben's a good kid, nice kid as well, but he looked really sharp. Uh, but listen, still, yeah, sitting there, I'm gutted for him. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. He trains hard and it's one of them, it's his first fight in a while and he's, he's got that attitude of, I'll fight, I'll fight anyone he did. And it, listen, just come unstuck tonight, but uh, he got caught with a great shot. This is the not so glamorous side of boxing, isn't it? And big, is, yeah, you're up here in Walker at Newcastle, yeah. no TV. On the, in the opponent's changing room and stuff yeah. like that, there's, there's no way he goes around there, but you know, but listen, he trains as hard as he does, and the chances, you know, it's, it's one of these chances he's got to take. You know how hard boxing is at the minute, you know, he can't, he couldn't go, there's no choice him to go to try and go as the home fighter. Do you know, when Levi come to us, that was his third fight, he's had a few wins, and it was, you know, we were just like, no, I just, I just want a real fight. He's got, he's got a kid, he's, he's got a little, and, you know, he can, at least now he can, you know, give them a Christmas and he's fine, do you know what I mean? He's just, he's, he's just a, a little bit, do you know what I mean? Yeah. I've only got you for a few minutes, Ant, before the storm comes tonight and it's going to get colder, you fella. Yeah, I know it is, mate, so I'm going to be, well, I'm going to watch the main event and then we're going to go. Good but, yeah, but yeah, no, this, uh, this Geordie weather, mate, it's Baltic, it makes, <laughs> makes Manchester look warm. <laughs> Couple of things then. Uh, Jack Paul, Mike Tyson. First of all, your thoughts on it? Oh, it was, it was every much the circus that I expected. And listen, we can't let's not pretend like it was. It was never going to. Mike was never going to roll back the years. It, it could have been a bit dangerous at times in there. It did look a bit worrying. Thankfully, he's got out there okay. And uh, the Jack Paul show goes on. I don't know if you watch Carl Frotcher's YouTube channel. He's talking you know about what? fighting them. I can't watch him, brilliant. He's one of my favourite people uh, in boxing. I just think it's hilarious. He just shoots from the other. He says that. He says that how he is most of the time. So not all the time. But I'm not. I'm not seeing too much of the review. What he said. He said he wants to fight Carl. Uh, he wants to fight Jake Paul with one arm tied behind his back and put an end to the circus. And I, I think he would be able to do that as well. Yeah. yeah. Million dollar crawler. You definitely get a million dollars if you did it. Do you, do you know fancy it? No. I'm not. I'm well and truly done. I'm well and truly done. But uh, no, I get. Well, and that's the hard thing, isn't it? When pros, ex pros, put the name in the hat. Yeah. It's um, it just gives him more credibility. I think you've got to starve him of that publicity, haven't you? Yeah. I probably won't see you before Usa Fury. Yeah. I have to ask you, revenge or repeat? Um, I think, I think revenge. I think Tyson's going to put it right this time. I really do. I thought. He had the fight, it looked like he didn't win, but you, you sick, adapted well, which he just sort of, you know, he finds a way to win. And how, how that fight sort of ended and how he had Tyson on his, out on his feet late on, you can only think that you has got to start through, but I think Tyson's going to put it right this time. If he does get through yeah. and be too sick, do you think that makes a Fury Joshua? Matchup, a British matchup, more likely, less likely? It makes it more likely, doesn't it? It makes it more likely, but I think obviously the person who should get that shot is Daniel Dubois. Yeah. Being all honest, yeah. there, uh, we'll see what happens with Big AJ. But if anyone should be next in line to fight Tyson Fury, it should be Daniel Dubois. Brilliant. Before you dash on, what, what's next for you? Next, I've got one out next week, uh, and then I've got three out on the seventh. I've got Owen Lavin, and I've got the debut of Yon and Gavin Croft, who, who I think could be something, something a little bit special. Brilliant. Anthony. As well, I'll let you dash me because I know it's freezing cold and you want to get home. Great to see you, Andy. You're always good to see you. Yeah. always good to see you.